but the combat. The combat is vastly improved upon the original game, uh, which isn't really saying much. You know, any game nowadays is probably vastly improving upon what the gameplay was in Silent Hill 2, the original. But it doesn't do a lot to, like, do anything crazy. You know, you have your simple dodge, you have your melee weapon, and you have guns that you pick up throughout the game. Uh, you don't even upgrade these guns. Uh, you kind of upgrade your melee weapons. And by upgrade, I mean you get a new one after the first one, and then that's it. Um, yeah, but the, but the impacts of the attacks feel good in melee. Uh, shooting is you know, solid. You know, you're not really fighting the controls at all. And it's more having to see the enemies in the darkness of these levels because, you know, it's not brightly lit at all. You know, it's very often you're looking down a hallway and you don't know what you're coming up on because it's just pitch blackness ahead of you. And the use of lighting is very minimal. Even when there's lamps and shit, it does nothing. It besides just add ambiance and creepiness to the scene. It's dark as hell. Uh, yeah. uh, uh, let me ask, it, does this game play better than the Alan Wake games? Because that's my big thing with Alan Wake is I love the narratives of Alan Wake, but the, the, the gameplay leaves a lot to be desired. Uh, I would say it's better, but not by a massive amount. You know, uh, I know you're a big fan of Resident Evil 2 Remake. That's on the lower scale compared to, like, if we were to say, like, Alan Wake 2, this, and Resident Evil 2 Remake, Resident Evil 2 Remake is on the bottom for me, definitively. Uh, I find that the... Over Alan shooting... Wake? Are you oh, insane? Yeah. No, no, not at all, because the, you know, the the aiming sucks ass. I'm going to say it right now. I get the purpose of it. Is yeah, that's intentional. That it's not supposed to be perfect. Yeah, it's intentional, but... I feel like with Resident Evil 2 Remake, you're just fighting the controls rather than engaging with a cool system. It sounds like you're just, you know, oh, having to deal with the cards that are thrown at you rather than thinking, wow, this is some, some good aiming, some good shooting. Especially that the fact that you're playing a guy who play, trained in the police academy. Like, you should have a steadier hand than you got, buddy. I don't care if you're in a zombie situation. If James Sunderland, the depressed guy who's trying to find his wife, can shoot better than you, you've got a problem. Um... And combat's not that difficult. I guess that's one thing that Resident Evil 2 Remake does better. I'm, you know what? This will be the last time I compare Resident Evil. Let's, be, let's be honest. It's hard to shoot people sometimes. Sometimes it's hard to shoot people. It's incredibly hard to. Especially uh, when their jaws hanging playing a video game and, and not you know, doing it in real life. They got uh -huh. rotting skin. It's just very smelly. Very smelly, I'm sure. You know? I guarantee you it smells worse in Silent Hill 2. <laughs> like, some of the places you go into, it smells like ammonia at a at a at a, the best of times. I can't probably. believe you think. I, I, I am shocked you think Alan Wake plays better than Resident Evil. Oh yeah, that, totally. That is does. absolutely fucking insane to me. It's got the the weapons they throw at you are more interesting. The shooting itself is more interesting as well. Uh, the weapon. What what weapons? It's a pistol, a shotgun, and a rifle. It's the same and, shit you get in Resident Evil games. And a bow. And the fact that they play better. You get a bow. Is what matters. Uh, yeah, the crossbow. In you Alan Wake. Types? Yeah, Alan Wake too. Is there a crossbow in Alan Wake too? I don't fucking remember. There is remember. indeed. You got the bolts. You remember you you even talked about how you would like use that a lot because you could recover the bolts. Oh, I thought you would just said you did that. I didn't. Uh, maybe That's I don't know. I don't. I don't remember. I, I I remember a lot of dancing in Alan Wake too. That's mm -hmm. what I remember. You know. Oh, there's a lot, lot of dance. A lot of dance. Not unless you want to go into the the modded memes for Silent Hill Two. Uh, you're not getting a lot of dancing in this game. Tough or any at all. Tough. Yeah, but you know. It, I don't this trust your gameplay of... opinion anymore. I, 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 just to be clear, I don't trust your gameplay opinion anymore. Well, that's fine. Resident that's in my old... See, uh, you, you, you made the argument that Alan Wake 2's, like, you know, it's you don't see it at all being close to quality as Resident Evil 2 Remake. Uh, I guess my biggest... Uh, I have two biggest criticisms. One is the gameplay in that sense. I feel like those third-person, you know, poor survival games nowadays all feel like almost the exact same. The most different to me so far has been Resident Evil 4 remakes, and that's why it's probably my favorite out of all the Resident Evils. Well, but... it's more of an action game. <laughs> exactly, but it, it plays around with that same, like, the same uh, the, the same uh, camera point of view, kind of the same general control scheme, uh, and due to the fact that it leans more into that kind of gameplay to being action-heavy, I think lends Resident Evil 4 remake... Uh, uh, a more fun it makes it have a more fun gameplay experience than the three I was just talking about because even though Silent Hill 2 gameplay is solid it's not exactly you know something I'm itching to go back for or I was you know super excited to engage with when I was going throughout the game uh, it's just you know I classify it under you know modern survival horror you know game mechanics I mean I, game I, controls I, my, my, my thing about it is is that the 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 I'll, I'll, I'll just speak directly to what I know like the the Resident Evil like at least Resident Evil 2 like with the like the shaky aiming and the mm -hmm. the uh, um, slow to recover on recoil type things 
um, sort of plays into the other systems of the survival horriness of horriness hor, hor, survival horriness. I don't know how mm-hmm. to say that without sounding weird. Uh, <laughs> of of the rest of the game mechanics, you know, the the limited ammo and the uh, limited health items and all these things, and 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 really dependent upon survival. Alan Wake Two to me is just a very very vapid horror game, uh, horror action game, uh, mm-hmm. rather where like. The game, the guns don't have impact. Uh, it's not satisfying uh, to kill enemies in that game. And um, uh, it, enemy variety is severely, severely lacking. Or at least, like, the ways in which you deal with enemies uh, is very one note. Whereas, like, in Resident Evil, like, sure, yeah, it takes seven headshots to take down a zombie. Or you shoot him twice in the leg, make him stumble, and you run past it. Like, that alone... Like, adds so much more to gameplay and gameplay mechanics, or you try and juke it, or you do this, that, and the third. Whereas, like, games like Alan Wake, you have to shoot and kill every enemy. You can't outrun them, you know, like, or you can't evade them, you know? Um, Mm -hmm. uh, If I jump over to, like, Dead Space, Dead Space, the weapons feel great to use. You can use them in different ways, and the unique game mechanic of aiming for limbs and shit um, makes the player be a little a little bit more creative you end up just going for leg shots instead of (laughs) headshots you know but like a little bit more creative in how they encounter each enemy especially as they have a wide variety of enemy types you know what i'm saying so like oh i get what you're saying to to me like alan wake 2 is just such a shallow gameplay experience like even though yeah it controlled quote unquote better um it 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 didn't mean anything that it controlled better in the case of alan wake uh I would say the thing that offsets that on the the better side of things compared to Resident Evil 2 remake is that while all those things are true, it, it, it doesn't engage with in the same interesting way. I never have to fight the controls with Resident Evil 2. I do to the point where it's not like making me feel like I'm dealing with these situations in a fun, creative way. It seems like I'm just dealing with inferior controls in a space where, you know, it feels better to play something like Alan Wake 2 or now Silent Hill 2 remake. Uh, okay. it, a lot of it is connected to personal taste, I will yeah. admit. But at the same time, I just like, you know, the survival aspect, those things are sick as hell. I've, but just never, you... I've never felt like I'm fighting the controls. Fighting the controls means like the character is not doing what I want them to do. Yeah, I always felt that with Resident Evil 2. Really. Like, okay. Because okay. to me, Resident Evil, all of them are like, uh, these games control a specific way, get on board or get lost. Um, yeah. Uh, or, or get, not get lost, but get on board or struggle. Mm-hmm. Um, whereas like, if you go to, uh, the internet's going to be mad about me for saying this. If you go to, like, a Mario 64, Mario does things that I don't want him to do. Yeah. Like, because because of how those controls work. So then I'm fighting him in that sense because he's not doing what I want him to do. And I can't get him to do what I want him to do. Now, right. is that a skill issue? Maybe. But, <laughs> yeah, like, that that's, that's what that means to me. Whereas, like, Resident Evil is just like, all right, well, yeah, you got to pace your shots out more. You can't go trigger heavy or you're going to miss other shots. Um, and I mean, for the most part, you know, if you're just not bad, you're not going to get eaten. So, you know, mm-hmm. maybe you just suck, Connor. Maybe you're just trash. Yeah. 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 Maybe I totally derail this. I'm so sorry. Silent Hill too. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it, 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 it plays well though. Track, but... What's that? It plays well though. It plays well. Yeah. It's not like, you know, it's just, once again, it's not like you're not leaving the game with the gameplay in mind. It's the experience that you had. 